Wednesday. A shave before 6 p.m. The tides are low at 11. Nobody went spinning this morning that we know of. We're going for evening spin. The plan is I'm going to ride to the beach with Low Tide Tim in about 15 minutes, eat dinner at the cafe. Then he's coming down about 7. Timmy's going home. I'm going on the beach, meet up with the uh, Mumbles man and hunt until low tide. That's the plan. We'll see how it goes. See you later. Good luck to you. Good luck to us. Well, I'm headed to the land of Nada. 35th Street. I have a get there through this passageway. We're getting closer now. Hotels. Timeshare. It's been really rough the last day and a half. You can see we got a lot of overwash. We got like a little mini cut with a cut with a wash all the way behind it on, on the upper dry sand. I know you can see it. And low tide's not for like four hours. We'll see how it goes. The biggest diamond rings I ever found came out of one of these little sloughs like this on the back side of the beach back in like 2007 or 8. The ocean is angry. It's got a tight slope to it, really sharp. Stand by. Man is coming this way. Then we're going to turn around both go south. Our buddy from Stewart, I mean our buddy Stewart from Halifax, North Carolina, he's here too. Oh, I think I already told you, he won't be here until 9, so we'll probably see him a little later if we stick around that long. Stand by. You can see this is where the tide came up and went back out in the ocean. Came up on behind me, followed all the way down here and tuck it out right along through there. There's a Mumbles man. Steady digging, Mumbles man is. He's making out here. We got plenty of jets tonight. Uh oh, he's got his ticket already. <laughs> <laughs> Stainless steel, I think. Stainless steel, Takeda. It's too, uh, it's too shiny for gold. It doesn't weigh nothing. I got you.
There's a cover off of something. It's still there. It's still there, then, yeah. This damn cell phone, them suckers can go deep, buddy. I don't know how they get so deep. I guess it's the mass, you know, to make them go deeper. Like sunglasses sometimes. Ah, we might have it. I see it, I see it. IPhone! IPhone! Then our iPhone 6 <laughs> busted! It cracked up a little bit. They took the knock the case off it! <laughs> well, here's a roundup from Wednesday night. We got no best of it. That was the worst of it. Four scoops deep, sounded like Empire State Building. That little sucker. I got a text from the uh, Mumbles man. He found a big silver ring and thought it had diamonds in it. Well, he called. He texted me this morning and said the big silver ring did have real diamonds in it. That's what our economy has come to. There's so many diamonds around and people can't afford to buy the gold. They're buying silver rings with real diamonds. More and more all the time we're seeing silver and real diamonds show up which we hardly ever used to see. And he got a stainless steel ring. I got pictures of him. And that's iPhone 6. And you got a picture of that or a short video. Uh, not going today. I think my buddy uh, Bottom Feeder Jim will be in town tonight later in the mar. We probably go spinning with him. And then he's going to the knife gig with me on Saturday. And then we might go to the Northern Territory, but reports up there are worse than reports down here. And I haven't got a report from my buddy Stuart. We saw him last night, but I guess if I had a, found that he had anything, I'd have seen it by now. So I guess he was mumbling like me in the mumbles, man. But at least he did get two, two rings. But that's like the mumbles, man. You know, that's, that's why we named him that. Okay, see you later. Stand by. Good luck to everybody.